Steam drunk? I've looked at the Super Nintendo Street Fighter games, Mortal Kombat, and just recently Killer Instinct, so I wanted to take a look at a more modern fighting game out of curiosity since, well, there's only so much you can do to improve and evolve a one-on-one -on -one fighting game, right? But that didn't stop me from having a blast playing King of Fighters 13. This originally was released in Japanese arcades in July of 2010, was ported to the PS3 and 360 a year later, and eventually to Steam in 2013. Now, quick disclaimer, the King of Fighters universe is vast and the gameplay can be complicated and I am by no means an expert on anything involving King of Fighters. I have a cursory knowledge of some of the older games, like the old Sega Saturn arcade ports, but if you want a more in-depth review of this game and how it compares to the rest of the series, sorry, but you'll have to look elsewhere. All I'm doing here is just letting filthy casuals like myself know that this game is, on its own, pretty goddamned awesome and worth seeking out if you're looking for a 2D fighting game with good old-fashioned fighting mechanics. King of Fighters 13 is noob friendly for simpletons like me, but there's plenty of really advanced stuff here for veterans to dig into as well. There's a whopping 36 characters to choose from, so there's a ton of replay value in just trying out as many fighters as you can to see who fits your methodology the best. The fights are three on three. You pick three characters and go against another three, and when one character falters, it's on to the next in the order in which you pick them. Every fighter has at least a few basic moves, throws, or projectiles of some sort. The commands for those are usually pretty easy to execute, but everyone also has at least a couple super insane batshit crazy moves that take a lot of practice to nail down correctly. Now the main selling point of a game like this in this day and age is how is the netcode? Are there any problems playing online against other people? In my experience on Steam, I had no problems whatsoever. In each review of this game that I tracked down, I didn't find one complaint about any lag or frame loss or anything like that. So yeah, this game is definitely up to snuff for online play. I really like that there's a rematch button right there at the end of each fight too, so you don't have to go back to the main menu and have things slow all the way down like that. What really stands out about King of Fighters 13 is the hand-drawn sprites and how smooth the animation is. My video here does not do it justice because of my dollar store video capture software, just take my word for it. But yeah, as you can obviously see, this game is freaking beautiful. The characters, the moves, the backgrounds, the effects, everything looks fantastic, and the sound is very good as well. Really, the only flaw I can find with King of Fighters 13 is that there are enough people playing it online, so I kind of selfishly made this video just to say, get this game, get online, let's kick some ass. I looked at other fighting games on Steam like Street Fighter V and Mortal Kombat X, but they're just way too overpriced at $60. King of Fighters 13 is only 20 bucks, and you definitely get your money's worth. Yeah, it might not have the humorous gory stuff that Mortal Kombat does, but for a straight up fighting game with near perfect online capability, King of Fighters 13 is the way to go. 